Dear subscribers and involved people, I want to introduce you compact studio monitors from the legendary German manufacturer. This is Neumann KH80DSP. Let's see what's included. So, let's open this box. Power cable. The manufacturer's website contains comprehensive information about these monitors, but first of all, I will talk about the differences between models with different indexes in the name. A. Analog input, there is internal DSP processing via AD slash DA but the input stage is analog, there is no D version of this model. G. Gray color version. W. White color version. EU, US, UK, different power cables, for same loudspeaker. CCC, China certified, different power cable, same model, different certification label. The main features of these model. Ultra compact size, DSP controlled by amplified near field monitor with big power reserves. New DSP engine optimizes output to achieve reference class sound. Mathematically optimized dispersion to deliver excellent detail in any surroundings. Optional tools for room alignment, configuration, and control. Let's talk about monitor design. This is in-house simulated tweeter with alloy fabric dome. Low distortion high frequency reproduction. Latest modeling techniques used to minimize nonlinear distortion. Elliptical mathematically modeled dispersion trademark waveguide. Smoother off-axis response. More forgiving of diverse acoustical environments. Wide horizontal dispersion. Freedom of movement across the mixing console. Narrow vertical dispersion. Reduces reflections off the mixing console. Two color Newman logo. Displays operation status and activation of the extensive protection system. In house modeled long throw composite sandwich cone base driver with extremely linear force factor trademark and flow optimized die cast basket. Damping of brake up modes brings low distortion at high sound levels. Linear pistonic motor gives a very low harmonic distortion even at high excursions. Reduced air noise and improved rocking modes. Robust metal grills protects against mechanical damage. Large high capacity flow optimized bass reflex ports with pipe resonance damping. Fast bass transient response. Reduced bass compression at high output levels. No coloration from organ pipe resonance. Easier to mount in tight spaces. Compact polycarbonate composite cabinet. Robust package for a long life. No standing wave resonances. Reduced diffraction and smoother frequency response. Standby function. Reduces power consumption when product is not in use. Control function. Use the back panel controls or the control set defined by the Newman.Control iPad at app. Four position low mid acoustical control compensates for nearby desktops fast acoustical setup in mobile applications repeatable acoustical settings after moving loudspeakers wide range input gain and output level controls easier interfacing with signal sources fully documented extensive mounting hardware range easy advanced planning for installations Universal double insulated switched mode power supply, 100, 240 V. One version works in any country and robust to poor quality main supply. Unfortunately ground loops are impossible. Network connector using standard IP protocol and your existing network infrastructure. Loudspeaker system can be controlled via the Newman.Control iPad at app. Analog input socket can accept XLR or 6.3mm, 1-4, jack plugs, electronically balanced with completely symmetrical internal signal chain. 
completely symmetrical internal signal routing minimizes noises caused by external electromagnetic interference. But let's talk about parameters. On this page you will find a complete list of parameters and graphs. For example, the frequency range in the window plus minus 6 dB, or plus minus 3 dB, but I would especially like to pay your attention to this parameter. Free field frequency line or ID deviation between 100 Hz and 10 kHz. It's only 0.7 dB. Look at the chart. He is absolutely flat. Striking line or ID in a critical frequency range. Then you can analyze the parameters you are interested in and predict the performance of these monitors for your task. Here, for example, the crossover frequency is 1.8 kHz. Eighth order with phase correction filters applied and the cutoff slope is 48 dB slash oct. There is also an infrasonic filter 61 Hz with a slope of 12 dB slash okt. Remote control available via an RJ45 connector carrying standard IP data. Output power woofer amplifier is 120 W. For tweeter, 70 W. 50 Product dimensions and other options you can see there. Comprehensive information. And now I propose to listen to the sound of these monitors on my old playlist. <laughs> 